Welcome back to the channel guys, my name is Viking Size Gamer and today I want to talk to you about a new different type of mode for the creation suite that I thought might actually enhance WWE 2K19. But here's what else I'd like you to do, I would love you to like and subscribe for more WWE 2K19 news, concepts and previews as they do come out because we'll be looking at this game more in depth and what it could contain, what it will contain and of course when the news officially starts pouring out we will be featuring it on the channel as it comes out i really look forward to getting to that stage with you guys we're going to grow and we're going to hit 10,000 subscribers this year you help me we'll join in and let's get this going now i wanted to talk to you about create a backstage area now obviously we do have create an arena at the moment and various other creation suites which of course, some of the ones that we do want to come back are things like Create a Finisher as well, but something new I thought would be Create a Backstage Area, and the reason for this is because obviously not every arena is exactly the same, so why should every backstage area be exactly the same? Maybe you'd like to create something completely different from what you normally would have in the game. Perhaps you would like to create a boiler room brawl, and you could do that by creating your own backstage area, perhaps you would like to include things like stairs so you can fight all the way up to the rafters, perhaps you would not like to just have to go through office to office to office and different things and you could place other weapons and things like that in different rooms. I actually think there's a lot of potential for create a backstage area, so let me just go through a few things of what you could possibly do. When it comes down to creating an arena, you have several different versions of it. You you know, you can create a massive, great, big, huge arena that sprawls as far as the wide the eyes can see. But the thing is, is that you should be able to designate how large of a backstage area that includes as well. A massive arena should obviously carry a massive backstage area. This would obviously give you more interpretation for you to actually create something, whether it has two floors, maybe a boiler room or a basement for you to fight through, a bigger car park, possibly more offices or a locker room or a gym. It could have several places, including an executive box or even a bar in there as well, not just the catering section that they'd have there. Depending on the arena that you're fighting in, you may even be able to go outside into the bit where the actual crowds would be, for queues and things like that, and fight in front of the crowd or within the crowd themselves out the back. Now obviously this opens more opportunity to bring in more props, and obviously in Creator and Arena at the moment you can put props on the stage or to the right as the left of the stage, or in some places you can actually glitch a dumpster right next to the ring and have yourself a dumpster match. In this case with Creator Backstage, I propose that you have props in there that are fully usable much like the electricity boxes that you have in WWE 2K18's backstage, you could place these anywhere in the arena that you saw fit hell. You could probably line them up if you wanted to and use them one after the other without restrictions on there. Now of course there would have to be space restrictions just like there is in WWE 2K18. You can't place things on top of each other and you can't place things in certain places like in front of doors. But this gives you more opportunity to be creative with it. So you could place dumbbells in a gym room and use those in a hardcore match. You could place kendo sticks around certain bits of areas. I don't know where you would put a kendo stick that would actually make logical sense in a wrestling arena. but. People bring them with them, I suppose. Steel chairs would obviously go in catering and things like that. You could use the gym. It would be really nice if they could actually put in OMG moments for the actual equipment that they had in WWE 2K18 into WWE 2K19. I would like to see an OMG moment that includes the actual running machines or even the bike machines. Just anything that you could actually use those for because right now they are just static and don't do anything currently. But of course that opens up more opportunity for them to put other things in there for you to create this backstage arena for yourself. Now the other things that you should be able to do in the backstage arena is place the rooms where you would like them. Kind of like a, a fixing position, quite easy. All it would do is you'd have a hallway, you could set which way you'd like the hallway to be. You'd have an entrance and an exit designated as normal and it would have to have things like a car park and the entrance and the exit to the arena itself into the ring area but the other thing that it would require then would just be a snap-on section so it's literally a case of moving a room that you would pick from the menu into a certain section on that hallway and it would snap into place wherever you decided to put it 
Now this obviously gives you a lot more opportunity to place things how you would like them, where you would like them, and change every arena so it has a slightly different look and feel. This opportunity would be great, especially for people who enjoy creating arenas, to create those backstage moments as well. Who wouldn't like to recreate the barbershop that Shawn Michaels kicked by Janetti through? Or even recreate the boiler room that Mankind used to hang out in? That means that you could have boiler room matches like you did on the old SmackDown vs Raw games, which means there's even more opportunity to put weapons in there, to have matches inside them for backstage brawls. All you would have to do is just literally put the boiler room on a lower level than the normal hallway, which would lead to the arena. So you'd literally have to scale it up or scale it down and use your, well, basically your creative suite to put the different levels on there. You'd have full access to a full arena, which really would make the game much more expansive. I'd really look forward to this. And in the car park itself, you could actually change things up as well if you wanted to put cars in different places, if you wanted to have four trucks in the backstage area, if you wanted to have more trellises to climb up, it's up to you. I think this mode would really be very, very interesting to see what other people's backstage areas look like, whether they were just a complete full-on bar brawl, if somebody just created just a bar to brawl in like in the old smackdown versus raw games as well that was something else you could do if they maybe wanted to do the hard rock hotel where they used to have things like that you could literally make anything you wanted with a backstage area it doesn't even have to be at ringside which just makes more more sense now of course there will be other limitations in there like not being able to use it online or probably not being able to use it in my career mode this would be simply limited to universe mode and obviously using exhibition matches where it'd be a backstage brawl in there but really it gives you a massive opportunity to scale things how you'd like them to make that backstage just a little bit more interactive for you and if you were to play maybe online and you know you were to invite somebody to a match in your backstage brawl it would be very interesting to see how they have all these things set up maybe they've set them up in a way that may have advantages for them maybe they put it in so they they have omg moments that are literally stacked next to each other along a wall that would make it a little bit more interesting why not have a car parked randomly in one of the halls why not have a desk and everything in the lockers along the hallway as well why not have all these sorts of things in there they could literally be anything in there but that would mean they would have to expand the repertoire of weapons as well so you could see things in there like drinking cups like they used to have in WWES Smackdown vs Raw games they could also have things in there like guitars as well because right now it's obviously very hard to get a hold of a guitar unless you're using Elias you could have championship belts being in locker rooms you could have anything really that you could use and get your hands on in the game it would make sense to turn it into a weapon this really is a quite an exciting mode if you think about it because the opportunities for the creations there and especially for the community creators it gives them a massive opportunity to create historic backstage times from the past any sort of backstage vignette that has happened before anything where a camera has been there to capture certain things happening any backstage brawls that have been happening in the past you could really get on board with this and you could really make it your own thing you could have backstage brawls from history boiler room brawls bar room brawls you could literally have anything you wanted to have on there and it would be a very interesting dynamic to play but for me, I would love to hear what you guys think down in the comments. Let me know down below. Don't forget, as I said, to like and subscribe for more Dodo E2K19 rumors and news as it comes out. And I will catch you guys in the next video.